Tiger Woods made a name for himself in the golf world, inspiring others from diverse backgrounds to join the sport once dominated by white males. And today, people of all backgrounds are competitive, and some are getting a shot to hit the green on a rising collegiate team at Prairie View A&M University. KPRC2 Sports, Ari Alexander, joining us with what you may not know about the team. And Ari, we understand the university got a, a boost from a PGA Tour player? Yeah, guys, Prairie View had a 40-year gap between conference championships but thanks to a new coach and now new funding from one of the rising stars on the PGA Tour they're set up for much better success. Golf. <laughs> well, nerves are normal. Is an expensive sport. I almost stopped playing it because of that when I was younger my parents could barely afford it um, especially nowadays to play junior golf. I mean, it costs thousands and thousands of dollars to even get to the top. One of golf's rising stars, Cameron Champ, is well aware of many of the issues that plague the diversity of his sport. This one's for Matt. Champ is one of the very few black players on tour. An extremely emotional one. And he's using his influence along with the PGA Tour to grow the game with a $40,000 scholarship donation to Prairie View a and Getting the initiative into those communities, getting programs around it, which the tour has been huge on um, with me and in supporting me, um, you know, what we did for uh, Prairie View a and The NCAA allows four and a half scholarships for men, six for women. And that would be what they call the max scholarships. Step back and feel that, then step back in there. This is Prairie View A&M head coach Kevin Jennings, who has led the Panthers to their first NCAA tournament appearance in school history in 2018. They did it again in 2019. For a top golf school like, say, Oklahoma State, they can easily fund those four and a half and six scholarships. For an HBCU like Prairie View A&M, it's harder, which is where Champ's help comes in. Well, that donation established by Mr. Champ will help us move towards that and help continue to change and, and brighten the world by educating some of the best minds in the country, if not the world. One of those bright minds is Christian Latham from Katy. He's an architect major with dreams of playing on the PGA Tour. There's not too many African Americans that play golf. Um, and when people do see African Americans, they tend to say, you're going to be the next Tiger Woods. But to me, I'm like, we're going to be the, I'm going to be the next myself. So what else can be done to give someone like Christian a better chance? Well, better access to the expensive equipment and courses necessary. Playing more difficult courses and better competition, you have to prepare for that. So you need courses that are going to challenge you on a constant basis. Right now, Prairie View has a start, Jennings has a plan, and soon you may see their players have a chance to be on tour. One of the main questions that has surrounded golf for a long time is black representation on the PGA Tour, which is still very low. But lately, the tour has been giving exemptions to the APGA, the Advocates PGA Tour. It's a nonprofit that helps minority golfers get that final boost to make it onto the big tours. So, Ari, I have to ask you, how much impact does the Advocates PGA Tour have on, on those golfers? Yeah, it has quite a bit. There's been a couple uh, golfers, guys like Kamayu Johnson, Willie Mack III, who have been toiling in these lower-level tours. Let's say you win and you get a couple thousand dollars. You place like 38th in a PGA Tour event, and that is a huge chunk of money. That's TV time for sponsors to see you, for sponsors to pick you up. And so by having a golfer come into different events and have that TV time and have that chance at a PGA Tour event, it's been huge for, for a handful of these golfers on that tour. And Ari, how many players will be helped by this donation made to the university, and how long will it be offered? Well, for right now, we don't know exactly how long it'll be offered, but as far as how many players it'll help, I think it'll be spread around because you're looking at four and a half scholarships on the men's side, six on the women's side, and Prairie View A&M can't fund all of that, so that'll help fund more scholarships. With sports that aren't football or basketball, there are partial scholarships given in sports like golf and baseball and, and softball, and so that'll help fund more partial scholarships. And this is not what uh, the only this is the start of what Cam Champ has done donated to many many other uh, things around here in Houston guys uh, yeah, yeah, opportunity is so important yeah, yeah. without wow. a doubt all right great, thanks for the update yeah, great story great story